this is Gaming V, and I'm back with another video for you guys. Now, this video, um, well, this template was asked by one of the subscribers for me to simplify the Infinite Jumper template that is provided by Construct2. Now, uh, let me go ahead and open up this template for you here. Should be down here. Infinite Jumper. There we go. Now, uh, let's go ahead and look on the code for Infinite Jumper. And right here we can see that uh, this is definitely not easy for any new player to understand. Alright, now uh, let's go ahead and see how it plays. Okay, as you can see, the player automatically jumps whenever he is or it is on the platform, right? And when the player moves, the tiles or the platforms move along with it. This is using the viewport. Now, um, <clears throat> the player is also able to jump through the platforms when going up. And whenever the player goes to the side, he warps. If the player dies, the entire layout is restarted. Alright, so let's go ahead and see what I did to accomplish this. Let's close this one first. Now, as you can see, uh, this is my event sheet here, and it's only six events. Alright, and one variable. Of course, I'll be using a different mechanic. Instead of using viewport, I use the bullet behavior, which should be a lot easier for uh, newcomers to understand. Alright, now, this is what uh, the player looks like, and these are the platforms. Of course, the platform has the jump through behavior, and the player is using the platform behavior. And warp so that whenever he goes to the side he warps to the other side right this uh, little object right here is what I use to block the player from going off of the screen okay now let's go ahead and see what it plays like and as you can see uh, the platforms are moving down at a steady pace and the player is able to double jump also I just believe that the double jump is a very cool mechanic and uh, if you don't want it you can always increase the jump distance or the jump strength rather uh, if you don't like the double jump right and you're able to warp across the screen just like in the other template and from what you can see on my event sheet it's a lot simpler for you to understand okay guys so um oh and also if you die the layout restarts so uh, that, that would be it guys, I'll be leaving the capex, the link to the capex in the description below. Alright, uh, don't forget to like, subscribe and share the video. Thanks for watching, this is GamerZ.